Oké, okay, ons kyk na die laaste video vir die week, the last video of the week. We continue with the vision of fractions, gaan aan met deel van breke. Maar is nou net een beetje moeilijk, is a little bit difficult. More difficult, not too much difficult. Oké, okay, so simplify, vereenvoudig. So I can factorize the top and bottom, so that's my first step. So I have m, m, okay. At the bottom, I first need to rearrange. Ik moet eerst herschrijf, so is m kwadraat minus 10m plus 16 voor ek kan factoriseer. Ok, daar gaan ek sommer my deel maal maak. I'm gonna change my division to multiplication and that flips around. So I'm gonna have, again I can factorize the bottom one. So hier een kan ek factoriseer oor die lijn. En dan onder die lijn gaan ons weer die oor die m kwadraat plus 13m plus 13m plus 12, sorry. Ok, let's factorize this one. Wat dan is wat is met 12 en dat minus, so it's going to be plus 12 and minus 1. 12 times 1 is negative 1 is negative 12, 12 minus 1 is 11. Ok, so 12 mal 1 minus 1 is minus 12 en 12 minus 1 is minus half. Ok, so ons het die boonste een daar gefaktoriseer, we factorize that one there to this bracket here. Yeah. Ok, my dialog is. Then, we gaan factorize this one. Ok, is weer m minus 8 m plus 1. Why negative 8 times 1 is negative 8 minus 8 plus 1 is negative 7. 7. Minus 8 mal 1 is minus 8. Minus 8 plus 1 is minus 7. So we're going to factorize it. Now we're going to factorize this one at the bottom. Now we're going to start to factorize it. So the body line at the top we have m plus 12 m minus 1. At the bottom we factorize it. We're going to now factorize it. So. 10 and 16, so we're going to have m and m, so we're going to have m minus 8 and m minus 2. Of course if this positive, both signs will have that negative, minus minus, 8 times 2 is 16, minus 8 minus 2 is minus 10, minus 10, 8 mal 2 is 16, minus 8 minus 2 is minus 10. Ok, dan sit mal, sit klaar boog gefaktoriseer, we already factorize at the top. Ok, now we're going to factorize the bottom part, nou gaan ons die onderste part. Ok, so let's factorize the bottom, 13m plus 12, because both is positive, I know it's going to be m plus, and it's going to be m plus something, what times, what gives me 12, 12 times 1, cool. 12 mal 1 is 12, 12 plus 1 is 13, 12 plus 1 is 13. Ok, and now we factorize. Now because there is a multiplication sign now, I take my pencil, we just get mine. So we take our pencil and we see what can divide out. There is a m plus 1, 8 plus 12 and there is a m plus 12. There is a m plus 1, there is a m plus 1. m minus 8 m minus 8. What's left is those two. So we end up, so ons eindig met m minus 1, m minus 1, gedeeld door m minus 2. So that's my answer. Ok, if it's in brackets, as it in arcus is, it's still correct. Ok, one more example, nog een voorbeeld. Ok, example 2. So now we simplify where we can. Here we can take out a common factor of d, so what's left is m plus 1, because one, the d is taken out. At the bottom is difference of two squares, onder is the verschil van vierkante, so there's m minus 1 and m plus 1. Die deel maak ek nou a maal teken, so the theory flip op, so min, m minus 1, m minus 1 is at the top now, and d plus 3 at the bottom. 
again my division becomes multiplication I take this to the top so therefore here I take out a common factor of 2 call a gemeenschappelijke factor van 2 I that play over d plus 3 d plus 3 2 times 3 is 6 and then we look at the bottom of that so now d is owner that's at the bottom so I can take out the common factor of d gemeenschappelijke factor van d can I get to that play over get 2 I there was 2 I took taken out 1 so I'm like 1 over 1 is left plus 1 is gone that d so the 4 is left now I take my pencil and I see what's at the bottom and what's at the top everything at the top must have brackets and at the bottom must have brackets ok so there's an a minus 1 a minus 1 m plus 1 m plus 1 d plus 3 d plus 3 there's a d there's a d so what do I have at the top I have a 2 left so body line it like a 2 over and under the line it like a 2 plus 4 I have that d plus 4 left and there is my answer ok guys here's the last work you need to do ok so here's today's homework Tuesday, today's Wednesday's homework ok so this is mixed revision so this starts with the number line and so on then we go to Thursday's homework number 5, 6 and 8 of the revision and then Friday's revisions number 24 Ok, please do the revision, please do all the exercises. So here is your oefening for the week. So for the rest of the week, here is Dinsdags in, Woensdags in, Donnerdag and Vrijdag. Maak seker jy doen die hersieningsoefening, dat is baie belangrijk. Ok, enjoy your day. Lekker dag vir julle.